Hello everyone. Thank you for coming to my channel, Trendish Teas. Make sure you like, subscribe, and share my video. So I just want to come in today with a review and ask you guys' opinion. Um, so I've been viewing some Netflix um, series and movies. And one of them I actually recently seen today while I was at work is called The Trap. And um, it has DC Young Fly, Mike Epps, Tiana Taylor, um, T.I., T.I.'s son. Um, I think her name is Loretta King or Loretta Scott. I forgot. I think it's Loretta Scott. You know, the older lady that always plays somebody mama or somebody auntie. Um, and it has some more characters in it. And... I want to know what you guys take on it, and I'm, I'm not going to say too much of uh, what happened. It is very funny. I do think that Tiana Taylor is a better actress than she is singer or rapper, or whatever it is she do. She's a good dancer, but I think this whole acting thing is good for her. I like her acting, and even though they put her, they always put her as the ratchet one or the loud ghetto one it seemed to fit her perfectly she do it well um again it's funny little hood so if you're into that i suggest you go watch it um it kind of reminds me of a next friday slash atl i see some similarities um, it's not that long. I think maybe like an hour and a half, an hour, 45 minutes. So you guys make sure you go watch that on Netflix. It's called The Trap. And then the next um, thing I want to talk about on Netflix, which I just recently found out that they're playing it on TV now. But I started watching it maybe like two weeks ago on Netflix, and I didn't realize that it it's basically playing on TV now. It's called Into the Badlands, and it's more of a action in a rural area, you know, that happened a long time ago. And I'm on it's on it got three seasons. I'm on a third season, and. Um, a new episode come out tonight on TV and again I started watching it on Netflix and I didn't realize that it was showing on TV so I thought you know it was playing on Netflix I watched all the seasons I'm done and then when I realized this it, it was playing now that's when I was like okay well let me record it on my DVR so I think it come on tonight I'm not sure what time but the newest episode come on tonight basically <clears throat> took place in a rural area. I forgot exactly where it's at. It's an action movie about people in conquest. Um, this guy goes through a journey of killing a lot of people because his it's called a baron. His barons say so. And it's a lot of barons. And they basically, some of them want world peace. Some of them want to be able to control everybody else. And it's a lot of fighting going on. A lot of, I'm not going to say too much of Kung Fu because I don't know exactly if that's the correct term. But a lot of fighting, a lot of bow, bow and arrow, a lot of blades and swords and stuff. And now it's to the point where um, one of the main characters, Sonny, he had a son named Henry, so he's doing everything in his power to heal him from this dark power that he has and basically keep him and his son alive because he killed so many people for his baron in the past that everybody wants his head. And now they to the point where he went to this um, guy called the Pilgrim for help. And he think he made a mistake that Pilgrim is trying to get. He's trying to be the ruler of all the lands. 
and basically giving him dark power but he's the only one that can control the dark power but Sonny didn't care everybody his friend Bashi kept telling him don't let Pilgrim take this power from your son we'll find another way to cure your son but Sonny wasn't having it so I think that's actually a good series and it's called again Into the Badlands so if you have Netflix, you can go ahead and watch it and catch up on it. I don't know if it's on Hulu. I haven't checked my Hulu to see if it's on there. But um, it's a very good series. I didn't think I was going to too much like it because I like action movie, but I'm more so of a Marvel, you know, superhero type of action movie. And I do like Lord of the Rings and The Hobbit, you know, old time action. So this is kind of what it remind me of. So I guess that's why I like it and I'm hooked on it. But I do think you guys should go check it out and see and then jump in the comments and let me know your take on it.